Hello, today's devotional can be found in Isaiah chapter 59, verse 19. So shall they fear the name of the Lord from the west, and his glory from the rising of the sun. When the enemy shall come in like a flood, the spirit of the Lord shall lift up a standard against him. Okay, so we are encouraged to respect, not so much be scared of the name of the Lord, And to show respect to it in our thoughts, in our words, and in our deeds. That we might be able to have his spirit to be with us if we so choose. And that we might be able to enjoy the glories that he sends to us. We are... The greatest and most complicated work that God has ever created. We are most complicated because we, besides being children of God, we're also mortal. And we decide things on our own that might be contrary to what the Lord wants for us. But, you know what? The Lord knows this. And he's not going to interfere in our agency. And he's going to love us no matter what we do, even if we do things that are not his way. Because what's the point of God hating us? God can be disappointed in us, yes, but, but, He will always love us no matter what we do. And Satan doesn't think we should love ourselves because when we sin to him, we are worthless and we should capitalize on our worthlessness that comes when we sin. Satan doesn't realize that he engineered the need for the atonement by tempting Adam and Eve to eat that fruit. But he did. And so, Satan tries to flood our lives with contention and sorrow and anger. And We should not be afraid to stand against him and seek the Lord's help in defending ourselves against Satan, for we cannot handle Satan on our own. Satan doesn't have any power unless we give it to him, but to resist him, we need the help of the Lord. And he will help us if we ask. And the enemy's attack shall be great. They shall be upon us. They shall be upon our families. They shall be upon that which we hold sacred and even against everything we hold sacred. But the Spirit of the Lord can be with us if we live righteously and if we ask for it. And we can stand strong against Satan and his attacks. We can stand strong to our standards. We shouldn't be afraid to because we will not be alone in the battle if we don't want to be. We have our agency. We should use it properly because proper use of our agency will keep the spirit with us. That we might be able to just stand strong. And live up to our legacy and our lineage as children of God. 
For we are of infinite worth and we may not realize that. And with that said, I love you all so very much. And I say these things humbly in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen.